Hello everyone. Welcome back to Velaxi Infotech tutorial series. In this video, we are going to see how to access S3 from EC2 instance by using IAM role. For this, we need to create IAM role with S3 full access and launch instance with role, then access S3 bucket with AWS CLI command line. These are the steps we need to follow. So I'm just jumping into AWS console. This is my AWS console. First, I have to create a IAM role. Jumping into the IAM service. In IAM service, I'm going to create a role. This role should be useful for to access your S3 bucket for EC, from EC2 instance. I have a already existing S3 full access role, but I'm going to create a new one. And this role we are going to use for EC2 instance. So you must choose EC2 instance. And this role should have S3 full access. There is a there is already S3 full access policy available in AWS console. You can choose that policy. Next step, I'm giving this I'm giving name for this role as s3 full underscore access and uh, description i'm leaving as it is and create a role now your role is ready role name is s3 full access as a second step we should create our launch instance with role i am going to my ec2 instance console launching an instance i hope you already know how to launch an instance otherwise you can check out our previous video where we have recorded how to launch an ec2 instance i'm going with amazon linux why because it is already installed with aws cli which we are going to use aws cli commands to connect to our s3 buckets Oh, if you want to know how to install AWS CLI, you can check out our previous video. T2 Micro, these are our defaults. This is where you need to provide your IAM S3 full access role. Both are equal, but whatever we have created just now, I'm choosing that role. And remaining all our default, it requires head GP. And I will name it as a name. S3 full, sorry, is to instance for a role test. Okay, just I'm giving relevant name. I'm using the default security group. I'm sorry creating a new security group and a launch. I have a key pair called Mumbai key pair launching it. Now my instance is getting launched with role. I will pause this video. Now my instance is ready. I'm going to take the, take the public IP to connect to my instance from Putty. Sorry, I need to load my keeper. Keeper is already loaded with this one. And open it. S is it to minus user. I logged into logged in as a root. Now I'm going to run my AWS commands by using AWS S3 LS. You could see you are able to access or you are able to see whatever is there in S3 bucket, sorry, S3 console. I will just show you from my S3 console as well. Here you go. These are the buckets. I can able to create a new S3 bucket through AWS CLI, AWS S3. EMB make bucket. I will name it as a Velaxi Infotech 01. I hope this bucket is not used by anyone. Yes, yeah, sorry. 
S3 colon slash slash relax infotech 01 you could be able to see yeah, make bucket bucket has been created I'm going to my console refresh it you could see Velaxi infotech 01 and you can remove bucket if you are not using AWS S3 remove bucket nothing but RB nothing but remove bucket your bucket name I'm sorry your bucket name it is this command is going to remove your bucket bucket has been removed this is how you can use here you are not providing any credentials to access your s3 bucket that is the advantage with the role but whenever you are executing these commands make sure that you are you have installed aws cli in your system amazon linux by default is going to get aws cli as inbuilt so you need not to install apart from amazon linux ami if you are using other amazon linux sorry other instance you must install aws cli please check out our uh, previous video to install aws how to install aws cli thanks thanks for watching if you like this video you can share it